welcome you to American Family Field in Milwaukee. Tonight it's the third of this four game weekend series. Yo, what's up, YouTube, man? I hope you guys are having a fantastic day, guys. Uh, alrighty. So we are trying to extend our winning streak. Um, we've won two games here in Milwaukee out of a four game set. And tonight, Corbin Burns is on the mound for the Brewers. He's not doing as hot at, in the video game as he's doing in real life. This is his six-star 0-1, 4.26 ERA, 25.1 innings, 31 hits, 10 walks, and 20 strikeouts for him. And his whip is a 1.62. And Gavin Lux will lead this game off, <clears throat> hitting 254 and 10 stolen bases, 10 runs for Gavin and. He'll lead this game off instead of Mookie Betts. Mookie Betts is hitting six, so now here's the first, <clears throat> first pitch from Burns. Strike, oh, no, ball one to start this ball game off. At first, it looked like a strike, 1-0 to Gavin Lux. All right, the 1-0 pitch. And now 1-1 one and one inside pitch for a strike. All right, 1-1 one, one to Gavin Lux. The 1-1 one, one pitch, 2-1. 43 yeah, degrees, clear right skies, and the and the roof is opened here in Milwaukee. 2-1. Hit the left. This ball will not drop. One away here in the top of the seventh. I mean seventh. Top of the first. Game just started. All right. One away here in the top of the first as the fly out the left. And now that will bring in Max Muncy hitting 200. Three home runs and 11 RBIs. <clears throat> Very weird lineup pitch. here, huh? First pitch to Muncy, fouled off a 1-1. That's a great sinker right there. <clears throat> so, lately, I've been really thinking about trading A.J. Pollock, and I think I brought it up in another video the other day. I think it's time that we, we move on with some of our players who are struggling, especially A.J. Pollock. Just because every time I have A.J. Pollock on my team, I really struggle with them, and I never could get them going. And, and the same problems happening this year. 2-1. This will be hit the right field for a base hit for Max Muncy. So maybe it's just time to say goodbye to A.J. Pollock and go out and get Kyle Seeger and then make him a utility man on our squad and make Matt Beatty our everyday left fielder because I'd love to have Matt Beatty's bat in every single game because I really dig Matt Beatty. Uh, here comes Seager hitting 357, hit the left and foul, the one. So proud of Max Muncy for getting a hit. <clears throat> a one. Now one and one. If it sounds like I have a sore throat, <coughs> that is not the problem. I was doing a lot of yelling yesterday, so I'm cheering. 2-1. Long story. Alright, 2-1. And by the time you guys are probably watching this video, maybe, maybe not. I might be in Alabama and I might not be, so if if there's a lack of uploads as Seeger's out at first according to the first place the first base ump. Let's let's go to the pitching really quick. Our pitcher today is Trevor Bauer. Uh this is his sixth start. Uh 5-0, 2.13 ERA, 38 innings, uh, 19 hits, 0 0.69 whip, 5 walks, and 35 Ks for the one and only Bauer. But anyway, as I was saying, so if this is uploaded, say if, it, say if today's Monday, the 20th, 24th, I am definitely in the air right now going to Alabama. Or if it's anywhere, if this video comes up anywhere between the 24th through June 5th, I'm in Alabama. Well, June 4th. We'll say that because June 5th is when I come back. And guys, the uploading might stop when I'm in Alabama just because I don't know if I'll be able to record. Like, I could record maybe without the mic. So maybe that's what will have to happen for me to record some videos to just play the game instead of record it. And then, uh, uh man, that'd be tough though because I don't... I want to have my laptop, and I want to be able to do the part twos. <coughs> I'd have to, like, I don't know. I'd have to put two videos up, like, because I'm not going to bring my laptop to Alabama with me. So we'll see what happens. Um, the old two fouled off. 
Daniel Robinson, the batter here. First time seeing him in this four-game series, the 0-2 slider. So we'll figure it out as that's the first K for Bauer in this ball game. <clears throat> so just be ready for maybe the lack of uploads and or maybe even no uploads. Maybe you know I go to Alabama and really enjoyed the time. I'm working on a documentary for the whole time going to Alabama and like the days leading up. So, um, you know, maybe I focus on that and then once I get back, I start uploading more baseball and football and Madden and all that good stuff. So, we'll see what happens. Oh, two to Yelich, one and two. Good eye right there. Beautiful take. Oh, one, two. Knuckle curve. We'll strike out Yelich. So, two Ks here in the bottom of the first for Trevor Bauer. Alrighty, Cody Bellinger leading off the top of the second, hitting 316. Alright, first pitch from Burns to Bellinger. Ball one. <clears throat> Two for five lifetime. 1 0. 2 0 now. Zero pitch to Cody Bellinger, two and one. You have to find a way to lay off that low sinker. There is two one to Cody Bellinger. Do any damage? You're just looking at either and now two two. Round out to the left side. All even at two and two. All right, two two. Fouled off. <coughs> Definitely should not have swung at that, but I did. 2-2 now to Cody Bellinger. Ready the pitch will be hit up into the up the middle, but the shortstop is there. One away here in the bottom. I mean here in the top of the second. All right, with one away, that will now bring in Will Smith hitting 328, three bombs and 15 RBIs. <clears throat> Ball one. Cut her low. Several inches below the zone, in fact. One oh. Fouled off now one and one to Smith. Now here it comes. Two one. I don't blame him for not coming over the heart of the plate. He circled this guy on the lineup card when he got to the yard today. He's been swinging one of the hotter bats in the game. Two and two now. Good pitch. A great cutter right there. Just an early swing from Will Smith. The 3 2. And that's going to hit him. So the 3 2 pitch hits Will Smith. And obviously that was an accident. And now that will bring him Betts hitting 2 0 2. Two bombs and four RBIs. Betts is having an MVP season. If only, right? All right, first pitch to Mookie Betts from Burns. Strike one. Good pitch <coughs> called a strike on the inside corner. All right, the old one pitch to Betts. Hit, and this ball will be hit to right field for a base hit. So a single with one away here in the top of the second for Mookie Betts. <clears throat> Man, I swear if Mookie Betts hits lower in the lineup, he gets hit. But if he hits leadoff, he just cannot get a base hit. It's crazy. Now right, that bringing Edwin Rios hitting seventh, hitting 237. And this ball will be a grounder to set and to short and a double play ball to end the inning. So exactly what the Brewers ordered. All right, Keston Hira will lead off the bottom of the second. First pitch, strike one, hitting 213. This Hira. All right, the 0 1. The cutter away. Hit the right field. Oh, Betts will be a good play. Yep, one away. Good job from Betts getting over there. One away here in the bottom of the second. All right, with one away, that will bring in Daniel Vogel back, hitting 194 bombs, 10 RBIs. <laughs> has really, really struggled in this series. One for four, though, in last night's ball game. So he did get a base hit. Oh, and two, beautiful knuckle curve 
That pitch was nasty. O2 slider away. Will be fouled off. Alright, the O2. Will. Oh, man. I think that was a K either way. Where was that pitch at? Can I see where the pitch was? Okay, no. It was, it was outside the zone. Alright, one, two. Cutter back inside. Will be chopped. Right in front of Bauer. Throw to first. Two away. So two away here in the bottom of the seventh, and now that'll bring Garcia hitting 200, hitting 200, and one home run. I think I saw first pitch fastball, strike one. 99 career home runs coming into this game. Trying to get 100 here, I bet. Only one one. The two seam fastball from Bauer, two and one way inside. All right, two one. Fouled off. Good knuckle strikes. curve right there. All right, the three two. I mean the two two. The slider away, way outside. Three two. Omar Navarez is on deck. I don't like where I put this fastball, but I'm gonna get a strikeout anyway. So three Ks for Trevor. Through two. <laughs> Man, that was a terrible pitch placement. Thank God he missed it. Oh my god, Miller Park, it's American Field Park, Family Field or something like that now. Yay, Pollock. Good stuff, Heidi. Thanks. All right, one one day, Jay Pollock. Two and one now. Two and one. Big sweeping breaking ball right there. Good pitch. But if he wants to get a thirtieth pitch of the game, it'll be fouled off. Two two. Right, the pitch. Three two. Most good pitchers know that they have to work inside and sometimes good AB right here from Pollock so far 3-2 and a ground out of course maybe Arceus throw on time one away darn it man oh that hurts good play from Orlando oh yeah Beat him by a mile. All right, that bringing Trevor Bauer hitting 273. Is it crazy that Bauer has a better batting average than Mookie Betts, Max Muncy, I think, and AJ Pollock? Does anybody know that? <laughs> like, come on, bro. Trevor Bauer has a better batting average. Yes, he gets less ABs, but come on now, like. Oh, that's, that's a K. Two away here in the top of the third. And now that'll bring in Gavin Lux, who lined out the left in his first AB. Alright, the first pitch to Gavin Lux will be a bunt. Burns, oh my god, what a play. One, two, three inning. That was too hard of a bunt. Alright, let's go to the bottom of the third. Omar Navarez will lead off the bottom of the third. First pitch knuckle curve. Strike one. One and now the 0 1 fastball. One and one. There's a fly in my room. One one. It's that time of year when you know there's a fly in your room. Like, you know, it's starting to be really nice weather. <laughs> 2 1. Fouled off two and two. Late on that one is it's fouled off to the left side. Knuckle curve three two. Garcia's on deck the three two pitch. Slider will be hit the Muncie, and he'll take it to the bag himself. One away here in the bottom of the third. All right, that bringing Garcia hitting two sixty three bombs and thirteen RBIs. First pitch knuckle curve, fouled off, strike one. 
I don't even think the Brewers have scored a run in this uh, in this series yet. So two games in a row where they haven't scored a run, and their offense is really struggling. Right. One two slider away from Bauer will be fouled off. Alright, one two. Two seam fastball fouled off. Oh, we're gonna go cutter inside here, the one two. Will strike him out. Two away here in the bottom of the third. Four K's for Trevor Bauer. <laughs> that was a great pitch inside. Let's take another look. Nice pitch. Alright, that'll bring in Corbin Burns. Heading 125. First pitch slider fouled off strike one. <clears throat> oh, one two seamer fouled off. Man, Burns got a got a good piece of wood on that one. Oh, two cutter inside and fouled off. Forty first pitch for Bauer. Knuckle curve will strike out Burns. Five Ks through three. On 41 pitches, I feel like that pitch count's just a tad high. But Bauer's doing fine here in Milwaukee. <coughs> Spencer will lead off the top of the fourth. One for one with a uh, single. Bro, Kershaw and uh, Bauer, I mean, not Bauer. Bueller are tied for K's. With 44 apiece. Trevor Bauer's name's not on there, but I'm pretty sure we'll be at the end of the game. 1 0. 2 0 now to Muncie. Two over to Mad Max. 3 0 now. <clears throat> Alright, Seeger's on deck. 3-0. And strike one. Good cutter right there. Stealing that strike on 3-0 was important, but you don't want to miss over the heart of the plate in this mm, situation. 3-1. Ball four, so a walk for Max Muncy. And now that will bring in Corey Seager, who's 0 for 1. First pitch to Seager, ball one. Speed pitch just missed inside. Hey, this is a perfect opportunity for them to get on the board right now. Lead off man has done his job. And now the middle of the order gets their shot at the play. 2-0 oh now to Seager. Badly. It's ball two. Bur He's going Corbin back Burns back is having a hard time finding the zone so far here in the top of the fourth. 2-0. Oh. And a double play ball may be RC at the second. Seager will be safe at first and... Should have taken that ball, but unfortunately I didn't, and now that I'll bring in Bellinger. Alright, first pitch to Cody Bellinger. Fouled off 0-1. 0-1. The 0-1 pitch. There goes Seager. Strike two, and Seager will be safe at second. Fourth stolen base of the year for Corey Seager. <laughs> for a minute, it looked like he was going to be safe, but he was. All right, 0 2 now to Bellinger. The 0 2. 1 and 2 now. All right, 1 2. Pitch from Burns to. Bellinger fouled off. Going down and hanging with it that time. All right, one, two. Two and two. two. two there. Into the dirt, in fact. This is a fun guy to watch when he's up there. Really battles. Doesn't take any pitches off. He's a grinder. Always seems to make it difficult on the opposing right, two, pitcher. Two, two. Here now the two, two. Hit to left. Oh, yep. Sears coming home here. The L just throw will not be on time. Maybe. Nope. 1 0 Dodgers. That stolen base is looking pretty well. Well, pretty good right about now. So, thank God we got that stolen base. That 
<laughs> it's going to be a run for us. And it is 1-0 Dodgers here in the top of the fourth with one away. Bellinger, a runner at first with one gone in the inning. 1 0. Fouled off. Lucky to make contact on that one as it's chopped foul. The 1 1 home. We got two balls, one strike. One hit. Uh, and that ball's going to get through. Bellinger's on his way to third. The throw from Yelich not on time. And a single will we'll get Bellinger all the way to third. We'll take it. And now that'll bring in Mookie Betts with one away. <coughs> all right, first pitch. Ball one. <coughs> if Betts gets a hit here, you know what I'm going to do? He's going to start hitting later in the lineup. It just has to be done. No more lead off for bets. Maybe. I don't know. 1 0. Yep, there's a hit, of course. This ball's going to shoot the gap. Oh my god, run! Will? Okay, so an RBI double for Mookie Betts. 2 0. Bro, you're telling me Mookie Betts is a better player when. Bro, it's because of the shift. When he, when he has to come up. And hit with the shift on, he struggles, but when there's no shift, it's like he's a he's a, he's an animal. Like it's it's crazy. All right, first pitch, ball one to Rios. Like it's just it's just crazy. Right. Fouled off. Left side, but well foul. Right, one, two. Hit the left. Oh, this ball's dropping. That ball's dropping. Betts is on. Oh, no. Betts will stay at third. Oh, bro. Betts is going home. Bat throw. Let's go. 4-0 <clears throat> Dodgers here in the top of the fourth. And that's a two RBI single, maybe. How are they going to call that? Maybe that's a one RBI single because of the bat throw in. But 4-0 Dodgers here in the top of the fourth. We're going to take it. and We're going to strive with what we're, what's happening here in the fourth, man. Uh, rough inning for Corbin Burns. <laughs> we have scored four in this inning. Oh, one. One and one. He's not in danger anymore, so he's just got to tell himself he's doing fine, and he just needs to get this inning over with. And one and two. Mm. Okay. Right, one, two. Throw over, and Rios will, uh, Rios, Rios will get back there safely. One zero. Oh. And this is a base hit for Pollock. Wow. Rios will take third. So runners at the corner for Trevor Bauer with one away here in the top of the fourth. Look at AJ Pollock getting a hit. So proud. See, I feel like when the shift is Pollock's problem and Mookie Betts because when they're up and there's no one on, the shift is so heavy on the left side of the infield that it's hard to get a hit. That's really the truth. It's not their it's not that I, I struggle with them or they're bad players. Oh my god, they will be able to turn two here. That was too hard of a bunt, darn it. But we do score four, so maybe there's a way where I, I could make Mookie Betts use the whole field and not get the shift on. I don't know. To the bottom of inning number four we go. It's the Dodgers. Alright, Taylor will lead off the bottom of the fourth, 0 for 1. First pitch, hit, and Lux will field it, throw it to first, one away, one pitch. One out here in the bottom of the fourth for Trevor Bauer. <clears throat> oh, look at the wins. 
this second trip through the order changes in oh, now bringing Daniel Robinson what kind of adjustments oh, for one and first pitch will be popped out popped game. up into left Pollock will be there one away here in the bottom of the fourth So two away, um, did I say one away? Now two away here in the bottom of the fourth, and now that I bring in Yellich, two for nine in the series. First pitch slider, strike one. The one, the cutter, 0-2. Oh oh, right, the 2 high fastball from Bauer to Yellich will strike him out for the second K against Christian Yellich in this ball game. <clears throat> Beautiful. So the batting order All right, I'll bring in Gavin Lux. 0 for 2, 2 for 9 in this game. 4 RBIs in the series, though. Right, first pitch to Gavin Lux will be strike 1. I tried to pull it back, just... I shouldn't have bunted in the first place. All right, 0-1. Oh, what a pitch. That pitch got me. That was a terrible swing. That pitch really got me. That was a good. That was a great pitch from Burns. All right, the O2, fouled off. The O2, one and two now. Hey, the fish ain't <coughs> out there on that O2 breaking ball, but you got to be careful because this pitcher might throw him another one. All right, one two now. Here comes the one two. Two and two. <laughs> All right, two two. The pitch and a strikeout. All right, one away here in the top of the fifth. Over three is Lux. I blame the fly on that one. What I mentioned, it flew into my screen. It's like, it, well, it kind of flew in my vision, but still, no excuses. All right, I'll bring in Muncy one for one with a walk and taking ball one. Singled in his first AB, walked in his second. Let's see what he's going to do here in his third. 1-0. Oh. oh, 1 1 now. Two one. Two one. Four runs, seven hits. No errors for the Dodgers thus far. Mm, three one. Three and one now. They know the threat this guy poses at the plate. I know it's a 3 1 in this Seeker situation deck. right here, but I cannot three, believe one. for the life of me this pitch. Oh, this is going to be a hit into the shift and, and two away. Two. And that was, it sounded like a rocket off the bat, but <clears throat> good placement from the defense. All right, that'll bring in Seeger 0 for 2. First pitch. Hit into the shift. And a 1 2 3 inning for Burns. Okay. Keston here will really lead off the bottom of the fifth. First pitch knuckle curve. Strike one. What a placement right there. Oh, one. The fastball. 0 oh, 2. They just have to find a way to piece it well, together. Two enough. Slider time, from Bauer will strike them out one away. On the base pass if they can get somebody on. <clears throat> Seven Ks. Is retired for the first out in oh, the bottom first half pitch of to Vogelback. Two seam fastball strike one. Comes on with one gone here as he looks at a cold strike one. Right, the old one cutter. Hey, oh and two. Beautiful, beautiful pitch. This command has been outstanding two. so far. Hitting Knuckle curve. Strikes out. That's vocal back looking. What a K. A strike out of the so game for Trevor Bauer. Bro, that was a beautiful pitch. Right, I bring in Garcia. Oh, for one. First pitch. Two seam inside. Out off. Strike one. Oh, no, one slider. 0-2, oh, beautiful pitch. Hey, the beat goes on, yeah, that's 2 knuckle eight. curve. Away from Garcia will strike him out. And a 1-2-3 inning for Trevor Bauer. 9 Ks through 5 innings for Trevor Bauer. That was a beautiful pitch. 
with more on this fine Saturday night following this. Man, that was nasty. I'm just re-watching Bowers' excellence happening right now with these K's and his placement. Alright, Freddy Peralta will be the new pitcher, 1.8, uh, 80 ERA. The sun now is starting to glare from my room. So, strike one now. The sun just came out here. It's like 6.02 at night, and uh, the sun's starting to set, and it just hit through my window perfectly where it hits my TV just a tad. <laughs> but it kind of it makes it makes my room brighten up a little bit, so that's pretty nice. I, I enjoy it. Two one. Just like the stadium. I I don't know if that's the stadium or the TV, but you see where number four and I think it's fifty and nineteen is. You see how it's glaring into the stadium barely. That's how it's glaring into my room. Yeah, that's the game because now the sun's kind of dropping in my room. Three two. Fouled off. <clears throat> Good conversations. We have in these videos talking about the sun right now. Three, two, hit and fouled off. Still full, three and two. Three, two, one more time. Fouled off. Swing fouled off again. All right, let's do it again. <clears throat> the three, two. Horns. Here's the next offering. And strikes him out looking great pitch. I was I was I was expecting an off speed and he went with the fastball and got me. Now into the box. Will Smith. And Smith one for one and strike one. I wonder if Ronald Acuna Jr. would like to become a Dodger. If only, right? One one. <clears throat> in that Milwaukee bullpen now was a left-hander started to throw out there. One and two, great pitch. It's not easy to get your barrel to a pitch that high. That could be an effective location as well as the one two above the letters. And two and two. You know, out of all the pitchers in this game, well, like on every team. Right now in the division, we have the best pitching staff, I think. So does the Padres out of, you know, the whole division. Good strikeout right there, by the way, from Freddy Peralta. So two away here in the top of the sixth. But if Shane Beaver, say if the Indians are doing bad in the video games, you know, say if, uh, you know, that their record's not that good by the All-Star break, will somebody in the NL West, not the Padres, not us either, because I feel like I don't need a pitcher, but will the Giants, because the Giants are playing really good baseball right now. Will the Giants... Oh, was that a check swing? Nope. Mm, okay, one, two. But will the Giants... This is, a, this is just an ideal think. Like, this is what I'm thinking. Will the Giants want to... The Mookie Betts, two and two. Will the Giants try and go after Shane Bieber? He might have to look I think it's possible. Uh, we'll see what happens because they need an ace. You know, they, I think they have Johnny Cueto. We haven't even faced him yet, and we're a long ways of doing that. As this is gone. Mookie Betts with a solo shot with two away on a 3-2 count. Oh, my goodness. Bro, I feel so much better with Mookie Betts right now than I ever have with him hitting late in the lineup. And that's my that's probably what it might have to be. I don't know. Third bomb of the year for Mookie Betts. Bro, that was beautiful. It's been a while since I hit a no doubter with Mookie Betts. And I'll bring in Rios. Ball one. Five zip. You're in the top of the six. Two and zero. Oh. Freddy Peralta. That pitch counts up there, man. And he pitched. Uh, the uh, game one of this series is this is hit the left. Uh, Yelich will give it a look, won't get there. 2-1. Oh, 2-2. Two two. Hey, this pitch better be careful right, right here. 2-2. Two two. man at the plate is three not two. trying to push something to the opposite field. Full count, 3-2. Hmm, three two Pollock on deck. Three two pitch will be hit to center. And uh, Taylor will catch it. 
And that will end the top of the six. All right, but we do score one Walk thanks to Mookie Dodgers Betts and his solo, solo shot. What a swing. That, was, a that feels great to see. All right. That bring in Omar Navarez. Going for one. Hit. Rios. One away here in the bottom of the sixth. <clears throat> All right, that will bring in Orlando Arcia. Next up is Orlando Arcia. Struck out in his last trip First to the pitch play. slider. Ball one. Good eye. Alright, 1-0. 2-0. Well above the letters with the fastball that time. 2-0. Knuckle curve 3-0. Oh. 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 That ball did not end up where I wanted it to go. 3-0. Oh. Right like and oh. ball four according to the um mm, darn it. All right, there goes the perfect game. Goodbye, and now that'll bring in Colton Wong. First pitch, fastball, strike one. <coughs> perfect game. Goodbye, bye. All right, all right. Oh one. Knuckle curve. One and one. I feel like if Will Smith would have made that so exaggerated back there, if he would have just caught it. One and two. Hey, he's been able to pound that zone all night. Yeah, Working one two cutter inside. That's Way high, two and two. Success. Counts even a two and two to Wong. <clears throat> all right, the two two away. Hit, double play ball one and two. A double play for Trevor Bauer right there to end the bottom of the sixth. Let's go. Good. AJ Pollock will be the first batter to face him. One for two is AJ. First pitch, ball one. Yep, that ball went out. <clears throat> two and oh. All right, two oh. <clears throat> Here's the pitch. Wow, two and one now. Two one to Pollock, three and one. Power on deck. It's been a great job so far by the eight hole hitter. If he finds a way to get on base, three one. And ball four, so a walk for AJ Pollock. And now that will bring in Trevor Bauer, who's 0 for two. Strike one. <laughs> you know, one pitch to Bauer. Oh, this is hit to left field. This ball's going to drop. <clears throat> Pollock's on his way to third and a single for Trevor Bauer. So a base hit for Bauer that will bring in Lux with runners at the corners. All right, first pitch to Lux will be hit to left. Yelich will catch it, and Pollock will tag. So six zip will take it. Hey, every pitcher likes to have some run score for him, but particularly when you're throwing as well as he is tonight, and he gets another insurance run on top of it. Next up is Max Muncy. Oh, I'll bring in Muncy. One, one for two. One on here in the inning. He's set and the pitch. Yeah. He strike one. The fastball that's in there for strike one. Hey, I still believe in my heart the best pitch is a well-executed fastball down the way, and that's exactly what that oh, is. Here's one. He swings at that. That's and a double play ball, that. ball maybe. Bauer like will not get tagged. Oh. Muncy will be easily safe. It was just hit so slow. Out. Stepping in next is Corey Seager. He bounced out last time up. Right, I'm Corey Seager. Oh, for three. No Here's hits for him pitch. in tonight's ball game. Oh my gosh. Oh one. I think I swung at that just a little too early. First time he breaks out a curveball right there, and it's a pretty good one. All right, 0-1. Oh, one. oh my gosh. No oh, two. Well yeah, the oh two. I'll tell you, he just doesn't look comfortable in the box to me tonight. He's been there goes Muncy. 
Oh, um, I thought I could do a hit and run. Alright, 0-2 oh to Corey Seeger. <clears throat> Alright, first pitch. Foul it off. Alright, the 0-2. Oh Foul it off again. Oh, two. The pitch from Suter. High ball one. one Love the high so before the right first there, ball, it was a five pitch so AB. Alright, one, two. Right the one, two pitch. Hit the, the center. center. That will end the inning here in the top of the seventh. Taylor, Let's go to the bottom of the seventh here in Milwaukee. Alright, Tyrone Taylor will be the first batter. Out last First pitch, up. knuckle curve. Ball one. Good eye right there. 1 0. It, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. The ball will drop and a base hit, and that will end the no hitter here in Milwaukee. Oh my gosh. Of course, it happens like that where it's a critical situation where I could dive. And I tried to get to it, and and I, I couldn't stop thinking about it, especially because after Bauer got that hit, they were like, oh, he's pitching a no-no. Like, after they said that, it just kind of ruined my groove, and that hurts. 0-2. All right, the 0-2, two-seam fastball, high 1-2. All right, the one-two. Fastball hit the center. Man, I bet Bellinger feels like crap for not catching that. One away here in the bottom of the seventh, but I feel like there was nothing he could do. That that dive was pretty pretty far away, I think. And yeah, that bringing Yelich. Oh for two. Oh one. Out of everybody who does it, it's Tyrone Taylor. I thought it would be Yellage or maybe Travis Shaw if they called him off the bench. This one's hammered to left. Pollock will get there, though. Two away. Two away here in the bottom of the seventh. All right, that'll bring in Hira. First pitch fastball, strike one. And ended up running oh, close to 110 down. feet to finally bring it in. No doubt in efforts his teammates are appreciative of. 0 for oh, and 2, two now. Pulling three off. straight fastballs here. 0-2, oh, fastball away. away and that will get Hira. Uh, and uh, pretty good inning right there from Bauer besides giving up the hit. But another K. Alright, new pitcher, Justin Toppa, or Toppa, Topa. Alright, Bellinger will be the new batter. One for three. First pitch from Toppa, strike one. 99 mile per hour sinker. What a pitch. That's not really where you want to miss right there. I know this guy has got power stuff, but you can't live in the middle of the plate against this lineup and expect to have success. Ball. Tried to work yeah, it back to that low inside corner, but it misses one and two. Hey, there's not a lot you could do with a slider breaking down and in unless you catch it way out front. Yeah, I like one, the two. idea of taking it and making the pitch. Oh my god. A little more hit I, tr I was looking at something and I bunted. I don't know what the Next hell I was thinking. Don't ask me. Alright. First pitch to Will Smith hit. And Arcia will field it, throw it the first two away. Oh, that bringing bets. Single, double, and a home run. And that's going to hit him. That was a nice. Come on, man. Mookie Betts is finally doing good, and you're going to plunk it? Plunk him? That's not nice. Oh. I better answer this, guys. From the belt, the pitch. Ball one. Betts leads off first with a pair of outs in the inning. 
Betts is on the move. In there. Now the throw. Not yep, going to get him as he swipes second. Certainly a very close play of second on that bag. So let's analyze it with show track. We all know he's got plus speed on his side. And you really see it represented in the top speed. That really made the difference on that one. And that misses two and two. From the belt, kicks and deals. And a wild pitch here as this one's to the backstop. And he's going to make it into third base now as I believe that'll be scored as a wild pitch. Well, some would say no harm done with that wild pitch, right? But I disagree. The runner's now 90 feet away from scoring an infield single, a booted ball, and he crosses the plate. That might not be the case if he were still on second. Swung on but fouled off to the left. Another foul ball. Men on third with two down. Lifted down the line and left. And this will not be caught. It's a foul ball. Ripped on the ground to first. And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. Bottom of inning number eight set to go. And here comes the first baseman, Daniel Vogelback. And he'll take strike one on the fastball, registering at 93 that time. Probably a design take right there. They need base runners, so one and one. they're going to make him try to bring the ball in the strike zone. One and one, the count of the Brewers' first baseman. Vogel back behind the ball in two strikes. One and two. Even though we're late into this ball game, this guy's velo is still top notch. This guy's a horse. Line drive, and that's a base hit in the center field. So the Brewers get their leadoff man aboard to start out the frame. Into the box, Avisail Garcia. And he puts it on the ground to second. A bare hand for one. First, and that's the very last thing they needed at this point in the ball game as there are quickly two away now. The catcher. Next for Milwaukee, Omar Narvaez. It's been an 0 for 2 effort for him to this point. Swing and a liner, but that'll land foul, strike one. Not surprised he's laid on a heater right there. Just saw an off speed pitch, wanted to stay back a little bit too long. Behind 0 and 2 now. Bowers ready, and the pitch. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Betts has a read on it. And he's got it for the final out of the frame. Brewers go down quietly. Now we're going to have a conference at the home plate area, so it would appear that we'll see a double switch here. Devin Williams will come on now, and he'll slide into the seven spot in the lineup following the double switch. Manny Pena will also come on now as he'll move into the pitcher's number nine hold in the order here on that double switch. Check swing here as he couldn't help Count. himself, oh, and it's ruled strike two. Bouncer to the left side. Throw on to first oh. for the out, and that is how the ninth inning gets underway. So here's the Dodgers pitcher, Trevor Bauer, singled last time up. Yeah, he showed like a little prowess with the bat right there, Dan. I'd be surprised if they count. don't attack him a little bit more carefully, this A.B. 0 oh, and 1 count, and the pitch. Here's a late oh, swing and, and a miss, strike two. Two mid-90s fastballs right there that he doesn't seem to think he can catch up to. I wouldn't be shocked if he came right at him again with another Inside, good one. Ball one. Dodgers pitcher trying to deal with a 1 and 2 count at the plate. Pretty good pitch right there, fastball in off the plate. One of the things you want to do as a pitcher, try to stand those hitters up. Misses, ball two. Two. We just saw a fastball right there. I would not be shocked if he tries to get this guy to go fishing right here and drops a little off-speed pitch in the dirt. And a swing and a miss here, and the first two are dispatched to begin the ninth. 
next here is Gavin Lux. 0 for 3 with an RBI in this one. Gavin Lux. And this one's down off the shoe tops. 1 and 0. Bases are empty here with two men out. And he watches one miss outside. 2 and 0 now. Hey, you want to talk about being in a zone? This guy's been raking lately. And it all starts with his pitch selection. Two great all right, two and oh, daring the pitcher just going in the top of the ninth. Uh, the two one now, so two one to Gavin Lux, two away here in the top of the ninth. Two and two, two and two into the wind up and the pitch. The two two, he stays out off, still two and two. 2-2 two, two to Gavin Lux, the pitch from Williams. This is our first time and seeing Devin away. Williams, which is pretty exciting since he's the there. new the sensation in Milwaukee for the pitching staff. 2-2, two, two, and this one, oh, this might be gone. This ball's carrying, this ball will be gone. Seven zip, Gavin Lux with a solo shot here in the top of the ninth. What was not needed. <laughs> but we'll take it, and Gavin Lux will take it. That one was launched, and now that will bring in Max Muncy, hitting one, one for three in this ball game. First pitch hit to center, and this ball will not drop. But we do score one thanks to Gavin Lux in his solo shot. All right, Orlando Arcia leading off the bottom of the ninth. Trevor Bauer is trying to do what Kershaw did in game one, and that's get a complete game. Oh, one. The slider. It, and what a play from Rios. He tried. Throw to first. Not on time. So two hits for the Brewers here in the bottom of the ninth. And that will bring in. Oh, well now in the whole game. And that will bring in Manny, P Manny Pena. 280 average. First pitch. Strike one. Oh, uh, one knuckle curve. Oh, and two. All right, oh, two slider, slide step from Bauer goes inside. Lux won't be able to get that. And the bases have runners on second and first with no outs here in the bottom of the ninth. <laughs> Man, that slider went no, like that slider didn't go anywhere. All right, that bringing Tyrone Taylor. We're gonna start warming up the bullpen. Let's go with. Let's go with the uh, Corey Knable. Start warming him up in the bullpen. So I looked at Blake Trinan. He has pitched, I think, about two or two to three innings in the minor leagues, and he has a 4.50 ERA in the minor leagues. So he'll be down there, I think, for a minute. 0 1 slider. 0 2 to Tyrone Taylor. We well, broke up the no-hitter. Nice 0 oh, cutter to inside. Will be hit to left. Center field. Bellinger will catch it. And one away here in the bottom of the ninth. Oh, first pitch. Ball one. <laughs> A double play ball would look would be perfect right here. 1-0. One and one. Can't keep falling behind and creating traffic. Puts everybody right, on the edge. One one fastball. Fouled off. And especially his manager. First and second now. One yeah, man. One out. two knuckle curve will be fouled Another off. Foul. Don't be shocked if this pitcher tries to go a little bit further outside the, the zone. Fastball he popped up. He Pollock. To he's gonna have to run in pretty. Deep, but he'll get there two away. I wanted a K right there, and now that'll bring in Yelich with runners on. Alright, first pitch to Yelich, slider away. Ball one. They'll see a Rias tomorrow, the Brewers will. 1 0. In the next game, 2 0. We're just going to walk Yelich here. Well, obviously not fighting on the first two, so it looks as though they'll gonna just walk go Yelich and bring on Keston Hira. First pitch knuckle curve. Strike one. Oh, one. 
so important getting ahead with the bases <clears throat> loaded. Already a difficult situation. Oh, and two. So want to make it any harder by falling behind in the count. All right, the two slider, the and the, the Brewers the will strike. not score any runs and in the game three either. Trevor Bauer gets a complete game. Uh, he doesn't get the no-hitter, but I'll take it. He gets a hit. And he had a pretty good game, if I say so myself. Uh, 11, 11 strikeouts, nine, 4 hits given up in total, and no earned runs, 2 bases on balls. So player of the game gets the win, and Corbin Burns gets the yell. Like, comment, subscribe, turn on those post notifications, and good job, Mookie Betts. He might be hitting... Lower in the lineup more often now, I think. 